The concept of herd immunity is basically that the vast majority of the individuals that can be infected with a particular virus are immune to that virus. There are basically two ways of getting herd immunity. One way is to have a viable vaccine and vaccinate as many people as you can. And we think somewhere around 80% of the people being vaccinated and immune to the virus would provide this herd immunity where you see transmission of the virus go down in the population. The other way to get herd immunity is for everybody to get infected. And we know that this virus causes severe disease. It can cause deaths in up to 2% of the people. And some people su suffer long-term consequences from COVID. This is not the way to go. This is going to be a real problem because if you start trying to get herd immunity by get everybody getting effect infected, first off, you're gonna have a significant number of deaths. 1% of the United States population is about 3 million people. So you're basically saying you're okay with 3 million people dying. The other problem is that our healthcare system is not geared to having to treat that many people. So you're going to have to eventually triage people and we might actually see an increase in the case fatality rate because some people will just not be able to be treated due to the limits of the resources that we do have. And then on top of that, our healthcare workers will be basically burnt out from trying to treat that many people and we'll lose a lot of healthcare workers that way too. So herd immunity by natural infection is, is not an experiment to do. It's pretty a terrible way to think about trying to get to herd immunity.